Hello, my name is Josh, I'm a librarian, and I'm here to stand up for banned books, specifically Bone by Jeff Smith. This is the first volume. I'm gonna read you a little bit from chapter four of this horrific graphic novel, so horrible, it is one of the most banned books in our country. Yeah. Phony! That's the second time in two days that you've spilled the milk. I can't help it, it's a disgusting way to get milk. Oh, I figured it out. It's because we're explaining where milk comes from. It's how you get milk. I'm not disgusting about it at all. It's disgusting, I have to do it, and I quit. Come on, a little honest work isn't going to kill you. <laughs> a little? That crazy old lady is running her butts off. <gasps> I said butts, oh my goodness. Kids, watch your butts. Milk the cows, feed the cows, take care of the chickens. Grandma Ben is feeding us and they stay in her barn. The least you can do is help out. The barn stinks and it's drafty. If it wasn't for the food, I'd take my chances back out in the woods. Running away to the woods, shame, shame, shame. We're gonna end up in the woods if you don't clean this up and get a bucket of milk. I should have known you wouldn't understand. You never had any real money. Uh, poor shaming. Oh, you know what's like to lose everything? You know what's like to be broke? I'm here, aren't I? Besides, you're not broke. You still got a water bills on you. Only a couple of thousand. It should give you some comfort. Look, aren't they beautiful? Capitalism. Oh, man. Ah! They're getting wrinkled. I'm telling you, Phony Bone. I can do much more of this. It's not for much longer. As soon as I find Smiley Bone, I'm going to get out of here. They're going to run away. Until then, just try to get kids off the farm, okay? All right, all right. Cool your jets. Hard to cause any trouble. Come on, seriously. You're going to ban just Smith's Bone? The good news is, is this. We all know what happens when you ban a book it becomes red. So please, when I become an author, ban my books, ban them so much that they get read all over this country and this world. People who are small-minded, you're doing the work for us, either stop banning books or expect those books to be read by everyone. Thank you.